You wanna go outside? Hi guys, it's currently September 16th. It's 1 p.m. and we're doing another Boston Day of My Life today. I'm super excited. The fall semester just started like three weeks ago, so we are about to be on week four, which is kind of hard to believe. The semester is going by super duper fast, but I have a ton of things that I need to do today, so I wanted to bring you guys along because I always get stuff done if I bring you guys. I've been making iced coffee at home lately, and I'm so proud of myself because I honestly forgot how good it tastes to just make your own coffee at home. So I've been using my Nespresso again, and it's felt really, really good. I love iced vanilla lattes, so that's what I've been drinking. I'm gonna tell you what I have to do today, though, because today's it's kind of a crazy day. I love making to-do lists. This is actually a new moleskin that I got. This Maggie's moleskin on it. I like customized it. I had another one of these and I went through the entire thing and I literally have logs of to-do lists from like 2019 or 2020. It's kind of wild. But I haven't had coffee yet today, obviously, so I'm still kind of waking up even though it's 1 p.m. I always do little boxes when I do my to-do lists because I love to cross them off. So wake up, haven't had coffee, but I walked to Grace, I showered. So things that I have to do today, I need to do a bunch of emails. I want to post on TikTok, maybe post on Instagram. I want to work at the library today with some of my friends. I have some homework that I have to do and it's like writing homework or sketches. I want to clean my apartment a little bit and then after that, I just want to plan some stuff on my calendar but that's kind of what we got going on honestly after reading it it doesn't sound too too bad but that is 1 p.m i've been using the laneige water sleeping mask for years i am so obsessed with it i keep it in my fridge and i just put it all over my face it feels so good on top of my eyelids too oh my god i look crazy also i woke up to a notification today that some man set his hair on fire in a pavement Hope he's okay. I don't really know how that would have happened. Or if he did it himself, I'm scared. Ugh. It's been a minute since I've done a Boston day in my life, but I'm excited because I want to start doing these more often. Because I think I only did, I did like a Boston weekend in my life last semester, and then I did a Boston day in my life at the beginning of the summer, which I didn't have any classes or anything, obviously. But I want to start doing more of them, so let me know if you guys like this video. And then something I got recently, this was such an impulse purchase, to be honest, but I've heard a lot of good things about Claude Lee. Claude Lee. I honestly don't know how to say it, but Claude Lee Paris. It's the E de Boute. I'm sorry. You know, it's the beauty elixir. It's literally in English right underneath, but it says smoothing, glowing complexion, grape, orange blossom, rose, organic, balm, mint, and rosemary. It kind of smells like a grandma, to be honest, but like a good grandma. I spray this sometimes in the middle of the day. Honestly, I'm already kind of making a dent in it, which is hard to believe. It was a little bit expensive, but I never buy stuff like random makeup stuff or anything because I use the exact same makeup every single day. But I really, really like this stuff so far. It literally makes your skin feel taut. I love it. Let's make some coffee. I need it. Look at how pretty that is. Are you kidding? Oh no. So good. Some vintage shirts that I just got from Threads. Wait, is it called Threads? Railed! Why did I say Threads? This one is so freaking cute. I'm obsessed with this one. It looks like it says mom. Got this blanket from the Lion King Broadway show, and I'm literally obsessed with it, and so is Grace. Much better. Ah. Here you go, Gabs. Aww. This is scaring me. Okay, all the dishes are done. I'm so happy. That took a good 20 minutes, but I think I'm gonna go to my room now because I have a bunch of clothes that I have to put away, so we're gonna attack that next. My room looks perfectly clean, but this is what we're dealing with on the other side. This is all of my photography equipment, it's your weapon. So much better. Okay, I was able to clean up my apartment. I still need to clean this Ikea little, what is this called? This Ikea shelving unit. But for the majority, I got everything else done, which feels so good. It is currently 5 p.m. Or no, it is currently 4 p.m. though. And the library closes at 5. So I'm trying to get there so I can at least work there for like 15 minutes even. The space is just so beautiful. And I kind of wanted to do this for the last like two weeks. So I really want to make it up there. Ugh. Hey Siri, what time is it? 3.57. I did say makeup every day. So I'll just see you guys in a minute when it's done. Okay, makeup is done. It only took me seven minutes. That's pretty good. Gabs is still at her voice lesson, so I guess I'm just gonna go to the library by myself. I would love to get Blank Street before or after, but I feel like after it's gonna be closed. And I don't think that I can bring a drink actually into the room that I wanna go into, so. I changed into this little oversized sweater and then I'm wearing it with my horrific looking Converse. They've been through so much. I really need a new pair. I cannot with her. She is just so cuddly all the freaking time. And look at her little tongue. Okay, so to pack, I know I need my laptop. Every time that I open up my laptop in like a public setting, the volume's always like on blast and there's like a YouTube video playing. Horrible. 
never go anywhere without my planner. This one is from Sugar Paper, I think. Yeah, Sugar Paper. I love these. I've actually used Sugar Paper planners for like the past two or three years, I think, and I just like love the way that they're set up. They make so much sense to me. Sketchbook, because I want to do some studio work. Charger. Oh god, that would be good. Oh no. Oh my god. That scared me. Ew, that actually made me want to throw up. And we're gonna bring a portable charger too. This is the fit. Let's go study. Um, so the guy was yelling at us to leave the library, so I ended up leaving. I've been here for like 20 minutes. I'm just sitting on common wall, but it's so pretty. I'm waiting on Gabs now. She's coming back from her voice lesson. She's there for like freaking two and a half hours, but the weather's super nice. It's extremely windy because of the hurricane. Hurricane. Just like enjoying the warm-ish weather. It's kind of very cold. I'm wearing no pants. I don't know. In literally like a couple of weeks, I feel like it's going to be freezing and I won't be able to do this. So I'm just enjoying it for what it is. Hopefully you guys can hear me over this wind, but it's crazy windy. That's wild. Anywho, just waiting on Gabs now. She'll come and join me. And I think we're gonna get Chick fil A for dinner because I am starving and I really want an order of Homer. There she is. Wow, she looks so pretty. This is like a movie. You look so pretty, Gabs. It's so windy. Yeah. It's extremely windy. I like, it. I like that though. You Ooh. should do half half down little ponies and all that. Thank so you. Cute. Such a nice night. I don't know how late the. Um... Chick fil A time. I saw dead. Yay. So I got grilled nuggets, fries, and then an Arnold Palmer. Oh. You've never tried an Arnold Palmer? You need to try one. Chick-fil-A has good ones. <laughs> that is creepy. Oh my god. Wow, it looks beautiful right now. That necklace on the top. Why do I kind of like this? It's pretty. I don't know about this. Gabby looks. <laughs> Why do I look like I'm supposed to be in like a little women time? Give me the butter churner. You think I look like a maid? I look like Cinderella. It's a little better. Okay. I kind of like it like this. Change out some rings. Oh, that is so pretty. Okay, so we just made it home a minute ago and Grisha's being an absolute mush. She's so freaking adorable. Go walk her in a second before it gets too dark, but the sunset was unreal tonight. It was so pretty yesterday. It was also an unreal sunset. So she's been having some amazing sunsets lately. She's gonna come over in a minute and I'm gonna help her with her makeup and her hair because she has to go do like this filming thing for a project at school. Oh my god, I know. And then for the rest of the night, I think I'm just gonna stay in. We're going to Providence, Rhode Island tomorrow, so I need to pick out an outfit for that. It's just like a little mini day trip. And then I need to work on my studio homework tonight, so we're gonna be making some massing models and sketching. We'll get started on that tonight, and I'm excited. I'm just here in my salon. We're curling her hair, and I've never curled her hair before. I'll only curl the frizzy part. Like, this is a frizzy part. Yeah, there is. When it's up, it actually does look better. <laughs> Don't touch my hair. Gabby, please. It's a little. Uh, it's bigger. I just remembered I haven't made a model in so long, so I don't even have any of my materials down here. I have to go all the way up into my loft, which is a mess. Mm, oh, my cutting mat. So actually, when I used to make models, like, a lot, I used to make hand models all the time for school. I used to do it up here. So, like, my cutting mat is, like, here. It's humongous. It's kind of become a disaster ever since that point because I don't really come up here anymore. Okay, I think I just decided I'm going to do it up here. Oh, my God, I was looking for this bra. I think I'm going to do it up here because everything's already set up up here and all my materials are here, so seems like the best option. Welcome to my loft. I've never filmed up here also haven't been here in like two years i don't even know oh i'm, I'm sitting on it brick my school always has this book sale and my mom loves gardening so the last time we had a book sale was like last semester at the end of last semester and she was telling me to pick her up some books i thought she would like oh my god there are so many there was more than this she just took it home last time she was here but there's so many she couldn't even fit it into her luggage they live here now Guess I can't work. Just kidding. This is a little bit better, so I'm gonna go ahead and do all of my modeling here, and I can sketch also. I have all my markers. Let's get to work. I don't want to do this all night. Also, I'm already thinking about when I get back tomorrow because maybe I'll just finish it then. We're gonna see how much I can get done tonight. <sighs> Let me get my Arnold Palmer. Okay, now we can get to work.
Hi guys, it's currently midnight now. It's been like two hours. I honestly had to just like completely focus because my brain was everywhere. But basically, I just figured out a million square footages for this building. Uh, so I was trying to figure out different variations of those. I already have like design concepts in place, but now it's just a matter of like actually getting the square footages in there, which is so fun. You saw me tracing over on my computer. I just used this and then I kind of made my own little light box for my computer light. And now I'm gonna chop these up. Don't tell anybody that I did this because I don't usually cut models with scissors, literally ever. Also don't do this. I'm just trying to get an idea of like how I want the layout to look, what types of square footage I'm looking at. So we're going to bust this out. And now with each one that I'm going to cut out, I'm going to label them so that I can keep track of what square footage is what square footage. Ah, it's very chaotic of me to be doing this at midnight. But luckily this is due Monday night, so I do have time. It's just since tomorrow I'm going to be gone for like a majority of the day, I wanted to like sort of get a jump start on this. I think we're doing pretty good. This is kind of like the hard part for my brain to like understand, but now that I got this done, I'm feeling much better about it. Cut up all my pieces. Now I have all my square footages in a row. So I feel like I have something to work with. I'm going to make a few different variations for like my building and then take some pictures, but I think I'm going to go to sleep. Oh, I also need to figure out my outfit for Providence. So yeah, then I'm going to make the models tomorrow but this way i can just sort of already have the layout done seems like a solid choice to me okay so i did some layout now we're gonna go down there look at grape she's literally so cute currently two in the morning now i just spent some time talking to my mom and then also picking up my outfit for tomorrow it's this cute little strapless romper it's from urban i've worn it many times i love it it's such a great staple piece and then i'm bringing this little sweater it's like cream colored and a little bit distressed on the bottom because today was in the low 70s and like low 70 is not that cold but it was so cold because it was so windy it's Rhode Island still like coastal town. I want to make sure that I'm not freezing cold. It's cropped too, so it's like lightweight. She is so ready for bed. Oh my gosh, you're so perfect. This stuff is literally so fire, and honestly, it looks pretty good still, so we're gonna reheat this. Okay, bread is good as new. This needs a little bit of salt. So good. This recipe is by King Arthur, by the way. It's gluten-free. If you know me, then you know that's obvious. But it's the gluten-free. If you just look up like King Arthur gluten-free focaccia, it'll come right up. I'm so excited. And then I always eat it with freshly grated Parmesan in oil. And then I also use a balsamic glaze. This stuff is so fire. Oh, I'm about to dig in. This looks incredible. Literally so good. A casual 2 a.m. little dinner. This bed looks so comfy right now. So it's currently 2.41. I just remembered though that I have to edit a video for my school because I run my school's TikTok account. So I'm gonna go edit that really quick so that I can post it in the morning and I'm gonna bring it with me. <laughs> and then I can like post it on the train or something. I'm gonna do that really quick and then I'm gonna go to sleep. So I'll see you after I edit it. Okay, it's now 3.30. I finished the video. I'm super happy with it. This is the end of the vlog because I am about to literally pass out in this bed so hard. Also, I forgot I have this little star on my head. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it i'm glad that i got to bring you guys along it was honestly a pretty chill day today except for the fact that i'm up until 3 30 in the morning but let me know if you guys want to see more of this make sure to subscribe if you haven't and i'll see you guys soon okay bye guys